uh, saw your fight in Luis area, scored a victory. What do you think? I thought it was a rather uh, convincing. You know, he did what I asked him to do. The body shot inside, and that's what we took the guy out with vicious body shots. Gotcha. Where is that? When you work with him in the gym, is that you see everything kind of come to the surface in this fight? You know, without a doubt. I mean, a little bit more jabs have been real good, but that comes with the territory. As his career goes on, he'll pick up on everything I tell him. What makes him such like a promising fighter, and what are you expecting from him? He listens. That's the whole key. He listens. Luis Harris, press a victory. Impressive victory, Luis Harris, man. How did it feel being in there? It felt good, you know. Um, we worked really hard, you know. So um, I knew coming into the fight, I was in very good shape. I knew, you know, I had put the work in. I knew the spawn has been all the good rounds have been in. So I was extremely confident going into this fight. I knew the opponent, you know, it was nothing he could he could bring to the table that I haven't already seen. You know, and I had a good staff, so I was real comfortable going in there. And um, I felt like, uh, you know, I took my time. I could have worked my job a little bit more, but I just knew he wasn't going to be able to stand once I hit him with a couple body shots. So um, I felt good. It was a good fight. You know, it was a, you know, it was a good win for me. What uh, gave you the edge in this fight? Like, I saw a lot of body work in this fight. I mean, I, I would try to tell people, tell fans, you know, that, that's just my style, you know. Um, coming up in the amateurs, you know, uh, it was my father who, who told me to start, you know, start going to the body a little bit more, you know, just, just try it. And I remember one time I got hit in the gym, you know, with a nasty body shot, so if I was hurt, you know what I'm saying, imagine what I could do to people. So, you know, ever since I was young, about 14, 15, I've been just trying to stick to the body, you know, get, getting better with my body shots. As I turned pro, you know, Eddie Mustafa Muhammad was, a, was an excellent body puncher back in his day when he was a world champion. So he actually, he helped me take my body shots and my, and my technique to the body to the next level. So coming into the pros, you know, I, I knew that was going to be very good for me and it was going to help me out. And I've, I've been showing it, you know, every single one of my opponents have been hurt with a body shot. I've been hitting a lot of people with body shots and that's what I'm going to continue doing. Well, how was the crowd here? You know, you're not fighting in Vegas. It's kind of a small yeah. town here. Yeah. But no, I, mean, I, I felt like it was live. It was live. It was a lot of people there. Um, I was lucky enough to have some family out here, you know, and I have a, I have a lot of support. Um, but it was cool. It was fun. You know, it's good to, to you know, you got you to gotta switch it up a little bit. You know, there are boxing fans all over the world. You know, they're not only in Las Vegas. You know, people love boxing everywhere. So it was a good experience to come out here into, to, to, you know, Shelton, you know, and, and, you know, put on a great show for the people out here, you know, because I'm sure they love boxing, given the fact that there's a lot of people here. Now I'm back in the game, just trying to display my name I'm opening my delivery, so deliver my pain And I show what I know, through paper and pencil Cause I don't rap about swag, cause swag is a bitch show Man, I thought you knew all the things that I 